We all are aware of the fact that WhatsApp was trying to acquire Snapchat, though it failed, but it has come out with a unique solution to tackle this problem. WhatsApp has now updated their app and brought a new feature that is called the WhatsApp status tab, which is very similar to the Snapchat snaps or Instagram stories. So if you were searching on the web for the Snapchat snaps on your WhatsApp or the WhatsApp status tab on your phone, then you're in the right place. Hi friends, I'm Wonder from Android Planet and today I'll be telling you how you can get the WhatsApp status tab feature on your phone. Before starting the procedure, I would like to tell you that there are two prerequisites to this guide. Firstly, your phone should be rooted and secondly, it should have the exposed installer installed. So if your phone fulfills both the other requirements, then you're good to go. Now, before I start the procedure, I would like to show you now that I have WhatsApp without the status app feature. Now I'll just follow the procedure and get the latest status app feature. So to get the status app feature, just open up your file manager or your downloads manager and install an app called W8 Weeks. I'll provide direct links in the description for the same along with the latest version of WhatsApp which you need to install in order to get the WhatsApp status app feature. So now just click on install and install the app and wait for it to install. Now click on done and open exposed installer. There you have to enable this app in the modules tab. So just open up the modules tab and enable this app. Now the next step is rebooting your phone. But before you reboot your phone, go to the settings of WhatsApp and just force stop it. Click on force stop and click on OK. Now I'll be back after a reboot. So hi friends, I'm back after rebooting my phone. Now I'll proceed further. So the next step is opening up the W8 Weeks app. Now enable all these three options and click on enable all. Now it says enable. So just I'll open up WhatsApp and show you how the changes have taken place. As you can see, my UI is a little bit different from what it was actually before rebooting my phone. So now I have this camera feature to share my photos directly without opening up gallery. I have the status tab and also the calls tab. So this is it for this video. Thanks for watching this video. Please take some time to press the thumbs up and subscribe button. You can leave your comments in the comment section below. If you have any video requests, then don't hesitate to ask us in the comment section below. You can even email us on the email ID which we provide in the description. Bye now, you guys have a great day.